going on people this is Spiderman here once again with another film review and this time I'm talking about a 80s horror slasher film called X-Ray or aka Hospital Massacre so yeah this movie is about this girl and she she's looking to get a physical checkup and she goes into this hospital her name is Susan Jeremy she goes into this hospital and then everyone in the hospital starts acting weird. You know, the patients, the doctors. And then, come to find out, there's a doctor killing everybody in the hospital. No one knows who the doctor is. But he's just killing everybody. Nurses, doctors, patients. Whoever comes in his way. And he looks very, very sinister too. Very, uh, very mean. A menacing uh, looking person. Um... Now, who is this guy? And that's what I like about this film. It has a whodunit kind of style to it. Uh, but it also has like some exploitation elements that I like. Um, definitely exploitation. But, yeah, I mean, I like this film. It has a good, a good plot, good acting, good directing, uh, good editing. Like, the music's pretty good. The music sets off the atmosphere in this film. Um, and the main actress who plays Susan Jeremy is actually a, a Playboy playmate. And when I saw her in the film, I was like, yeah, I believe it. She's pretty gorgeous. She's a 10. Uh, but her acting was also pretty good. I like the way she acted in this film. Of course, I've never seen any of her other films or any of her other Playboy stuff. But for this, this was a good film that she did. And yeah, man, it's also like... Like, you could consider this a slasher film, but it's also a mystery whodunit thriller, which I like. And yeah, I enjoyed this film very much. A lot of people saying that this film kind of is similar to Halloween 2. Because Halloween 2, as you guys know, takes place in the hospital and, you know, it's the same thing. That's what I thought too, but I think this film stands on its own. And you guys should definitely watch it. Um... It's got very good, or it's some good gore in here for the, for the 80s, for 80s standards. Um, and it's not that very long. It's only like 89 minutes, so it's not going to drag for long too much. But I highly recommend you guys check it. I think it's a very underrated movie. And for a movie that I never heard of, it's actually pretty good. And a lot of slashers that came out around the 1980 or 81. Uh, but yeah, I highly recommend X-Ray. Uh, would I recommend you guys get it on Blu-ray or DVD? Yes. If you can get it on Blu-ray or DVD, definitely check it out or stream it. I give this film an 8.5 out of 10 because I like slasher films. But I also like slasher films with a whodunit kind of vibe to it. And this had it. So, yeah. I enjoyed it. I highly recommend you guys check it out. 100 subscribers. Peace.